Whoa, it's Pews and Azure. Hey. And we decided to do some serious playthrough for a little game that just came out. We, we saw some reviews for it um, that got us pretty excited. Um, actually, we saw some previews that got us really excited. Actually, yeah, the previews got us excited. The movie originally is what actually got us excited, so yeah. it doesn't actually really matter Back to us so much. But, um, yeah, we got MSN. <laughs> we had Todd actually, Henry. Actually, I got the NBC, yeah, the NBC website because I wanted to look at that uh, video of the meteor that fell in Russia because the heck, that's cool and awesome and frightening. And then, oh, look, Aliens, Colonial Marines, suffers from a boring story for your graphics that makes you feel... Like the last, last generation, generation game. NBC News are Ten Todd, Todd Kenrick. So, so we're gonna go ahead. This is actually our first playthrough. We have not uh, played this game at all yet, and uh, we got uh, we're gonna do some full playthrough with split screen on uh, on something. I don't know what difficulty yet. We're, just, we're really mostly here for yeah. the story <laughs> and the uh, the ambiance. Yeah. And, and the oh, and the beer. And the beer. <laughs> because this is brew gaming, so naturally we're drinking quite a bit of beer through this playthrough. This is all going to be in one sit one sit down. So I know this is uh, supposed to be a short game, so that'll make it actually possible. So uh, yeah, we're starting off with some new Belgium beers. Um, uh, what are you drinking right now? Ranger Rich? IPA. And I'm enjoying the triple ale brewed with coriander. Yeah. Alright, so it's, it's yeah. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're anyway, gonna loosen up by the end of that. <laughs> However, this game's gonna end. We'll probably remember it. Okay, go. Uh, you do it. Do it. Top. Yeah, you know, I just, I just want to say, and, and I know I told you this story, but you know, might as well tell everybody else. But uh, it, it, it was really fun picking up this game from the from the store because it came with an audible disclaimer from the from the clerk. Oh yeah, <laughs> yeah. How'd that go? There All right, it, it went a little something like this. It was a GameStop. I pick up the game. I I, I get my receipt. It says, "All right, I'm here to pick up." Pick up a free order. He goes, "Aliens or aliens? Uh, Colonial Marines." He's like, "Yep." And he looks at me, and he goes, "You know, just wondering. Do you know?" And I started hanging my head in shame, and I said, <laughs> "I know, know exactly." That's what he literally said. He said, "Do you know? Do you know?" <laughs> and then that's all he said. He said, "Do you know?" And then I just hung my head in shame, and I said, "Yes, I know. I know exactly what you're going to say." And he said, "What am I going to say? What is it that I'm going to say?" I was like, I've already seen the reviews. <laughs> yeah, I, I understand that this game is generally <laughs> not good, according to everyone who's read it, except for that one guy from Electronic Games Lovely or whatever. Yeah, there's that Who one gave it a frickin' 90. Nine, nine, I mean, I've been looking at yeah. this game for like five years or seven years, or like whenever they first announced it, like, oh, that's awesome, let's do this. Yeah. Um, but, uh,. Wow, look at the great, great uh, loading screen. I mean, it's I mean, like, I actually like this. And it looks, but, but anyway, yeah, so I had like this great conversation, and, and the best part about this is that I pre-ordered it the night before. Yeah, and, that's right. and, and, and the guy the night before, a different guy, you know, I asked me what do I want it for, and I said, oh, new downloadable content installed, limited edition. Heck yeah, that's right, I already did that. And the guy asked me, all right, what a for? And I said, for Xbox. He said, oh, get it for PS3. He was like, join the dark side. Join the dark side. I said, you know what? I have a PS3. I got it for Skyrim. <laughs> so, Xbox, please. Yeah. Yeah, so I kind of shut him up. And then, of course, I get my up. It's when I walk in the next morning, hit my head and shave and pick up this game. Um, so, good stuff. Good, sh good stuff. Uh, very versatile fellow. Had a, had a decent conversation about uh, my poor choices in life. But, you know, let me see. <laughs> uh, join. Oh, am I not? Yeah, so you get so join. Oh, oh, there we are. This, Azure this is just like Halo, it looked, or like I remember when we played Reach. Oh yeah, I think the other Halo games are like this too. Exactly like Reach. Well, I'm saying, well, I'm saying like that. Well, just kind of how the layout is for the menus. I kind of like it. I will, I will say that I, I when I first like got the stuff, this is our first playthrough. It's a couple days after the game has been released. Turn the darkness down. Oh yeah, a little bit, a little, uh, little bit. Just a couple um, inches. Maybe. Uh, yeah, this is what we're doing this on a Friday. Game came out on Tuesday. I did load up the screen because I thought maybe there was something I could input the uh, the codes I got for the multiplayer stuff on here, but then I real but then I realized oh, that's right, this game is based on 1985 technology, so it didn't have that option. Yeah, but I'm like looking at like the planet, and, like all the flashing flashing happening, and I'm going, oh my god, I hope that's not a texture issue. 
<laughs> like God, if, they, if, they're, if no, the planet is flashing and, every, and it's just, that's right. This planet is full of lightning. Now, when you uh, put it in, there was a you did start it, so there was a patch. Yes. Okay, so, yeah, so you got all, the day one so, patch. Yeah, okay. so, so I did that. It downloaded it all of three stuff. seconds. Okay. Yeah, it, it supposedly fixed all this. So what, what are our options here? Well, okay. There's random. Oh, <laughs> we're not doing random. Okay. What? We're starting with distress. Um, and then there's uh, challenges, but difficulty, uh, recruit, that's now we're not doing recruit, there's soldier, re wait, oh, oh, here we go, uh, hardened and ultimate badass. Now, is there any explanation for these difficulties? Well, I've heard ultimate badass is the way to go for, because otherwise the stuff's a bit too easy, but we're mostly in this for the story and we're just going to sit down and do this one. We time. also suck. And I, you might, you're probably able to switch the difficulty in the settings, so I actually think we should just start with soldier. Okay. Really? Just, just normal. Not hardened? Um, uh, all right, uh, okay. Yeah, let's start with soldier what? because can, you know what? I bet we can switch it if if it, if it's really that bad. Yeah, yeah. I bet we can switch it. Okay. So, and then there's challenges. So, and I, I remember hearing you can you can do these to get extra XP because you. So our, them so our challenges to buy shit. This has RPG elements in it. You purchase co solid purchase quality uh, RPG elements. Complete campaign mission. Oh, okay, so that you get for we just get from it being mission. Purchase a marine weapon. So, oh, or Zeno. Because, you know, uh, it's probably for multiplayer. So, whatever. I, it sounds like we just have to play. Um, oh, what's X? Click X. Advanced options. Uh, network type. Uh, Game yeah. campaign. No, we're doing offline. I don't want to queue us up with more people. Oh, God. <laughs> no, it's just going to be the two of us. Yeah, because it says, sure, because it the says last... uh, host game or, or search for game. I just want to play game. Oh, gosh, yeah. No, okay. no, no. That's okay. Because okay. I don't want a 12-year-old kid who maybe seen Alien once. Come in and just start going. There's like, too many people. So much, so much <laughs> there's, vanity. there's way too much negative, uh, negative feelings towards this game. Yeah. All right, should we jump in? Let's polarize this crap. For cutscenes, we're gonna go. We're gonna take the express elevator. <laughs> Love it or hate it, let's, let's dive in. Hell, going down. <laughs> but we're gonna, we're watching all the cutscenes, so shut up. Yeah. Seriously. <laughs> we are not space barring this crap. I heard story is one of the big redeeming features, and it's not that big. But that is not what I've heard. Yeah. <laughs> I've heard it's, it's decent. Alright. Oh, hey. Alright. Unfortunately, this is the actual frame rate of the game. Oh, God. Is this from the movie? No. Two human females, one of which is a child, and a damaged synthetic. Consider all Colonial Marines dispatched to LV-426 to be KIA. Repeat, all Marines dispatched to LV-426 with KIA. Pretty cool if they got Michael Bane back in for this. Oh, well, think about it. When was the last thing Michael Bane was... Like, I don't know. <laughs> I think the last thing I, I actually know, saw him in and recognized him, I think, was Tombstone. Okay. Right. like Johnny Ringo. I want to try to I like spend... music. <laughs> okay. And sorry, anyway, continue. I say, I want to try to no, spend... no, 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 music. Okay. <laughs> okay I'm, I'm done. Sorry. I want to try to spend... <laughs> I'm done. As much time as possible finding uh, references to the movie. I don't think we're going to have a problem. Because I mean, that's a reference to the movie right there. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <I wanna laughs> Aliens, Colonial Marines. By the way, I really enjoyed the block type. Maybe we should have subtitles on. Nah, yeah. Alright, way too late. We're not in Kansas are anymore. Marines? For any new recruits, I'm Captain Cruz. And you are my crew on the USS Sephora. We responded wow. to a distress call sent out 17 weeks ago from the USS Sulaco. Rhino 23 went in first and encountered wow. heavy resistance. Delightful. You were the last of the battalion to get popped out across. The voice seeking so is kind of bad. Because we let you lughead sleep in late. Get I don't know, man. I liked Pat the Neo. That's all I gotta say. <laughs> For the Matrix game, that game is horrible, but I still enjoyed it because I like Matrix so much. So I'm still thinking I'm gonna enjoy this. Yeah. yeah! Corporal Christopher Winter. No. By the way, if you're ever that close to Lance Henriksen, you're probably already dead. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I love you, man. He's kind of like... I, I hope to see more in the Mass Effect games that will no longer be called Mass Effect. Really? Probably because the realizer are destroyed. Uh, yeah, apparently they're not going to call it Mass Effect anymore. It'll still be in the same universe. I'm feeling good, Captain. But I'm worried about two. I'm a noob. Sauce. Real good. I'm sending you in to catch up with Rhino 21. We're trying to get the Sulaco flight recorder so we can see who caused this. 
Sir, what happened in there? Let me shit the bed. Oh! Attention, oh. chicks and dicks of the USS Sephora. As of right this second, Rhino 2-1 and Rhino 2-3 are fighting to get a hold of the situation we're in. We don't oh, dude, he doesn't have a leg. Over the next two hours, we're going to send a series of drop oh, ships over to gimmick. aid with Cassidy it is. on the USS Sephora. <laughs> that's straight from Reach, that chick with the robot arm. Yeah. How is it back over this planet? Lieutenant Reed, thanks for the interruption. We don't know how that boat got back here. Right now, Women. we're worried about what's killing our Marines in there. This is a lit oh, situation. Oh, yeah, true. <laughs> Sienna is in the background playing some WoW right now. Good hunting, Marines. Oorah to ash. Oorah! Oorah to ashes? Is that what he said? Maybe. I think that's what he said. Huh. Listen up. What I need right now is information. No heroics, no bullshit. I need you to be my eyes in there. Report back anything you oh, see. screen tearing. Know what I'm up Roger that. <laughs> no Rhino two one. I'm en route to their location. Just curious. Is, is there actually is he actually going to stay on the ship this time? Like, shouldn't there actually be a crew on the ship while there's uh, people doing things off yeah, the ship? Yeah, I would think so. that was one thing that bugged me about aliens. That yeah, like everybody left. Everybody left. Everybody left. All twelve of them. All right, so what do we got? Or uh, 14. So we are in the game here. 15. Oh, crap. Oh, I got Mohawk? Oh, I don't even have a helmet. Dude. So what's up, soap? Yeah, it looks like soap. It's Asian soap, though. Okay. I'm trying not to be racist right now. Okay, what it says on the... Uh, that. There's Corporal Weber. Pam. Pam. Private Give me... <laughs> give me Pam on right. Hold the man. Left, left, Lieutenant Corporal Farrell. I wonder if these are just names of people. Annie Walker. I bet these are just names of people that are on like the private team. first class. Jay Smith, Lauren Clark. Isn't that the doctor? Um, what if they were all names of Doctor Who's? Uh, <laughs> that would be weird. Purple Weber. Okay. He's most important like, thing. Hey, wait, wait, wait. You know, there's one thing that's going to actually basically rate this game out of out of ten for me. Is if I can slam my boot on the oh! locker. And, oh. All right, ten out of ten. I was 10. gonna slam my boot on the locker and uh, it's got if I could tie it. It's ten out of ten. It's got the pulse rifle sound, man. Oh, it's good and no friendly fire. That's for the best. All right, let's go. Toot tutorial. Let's do it. We should probably not skip those. Drop right? it. Yeah, let's. Okay. Objective. All right, that. Okay. I don't think I'm waiting for you. You got? know, we're going into space. We have Shotgun. some sort of like, I don't know, breathing apparatus or it's, oh, there's a bridge. No, it's a bridge. It's a it's a cord of, of life. Ah! Oh, oh, well. Splat. Winner, what the hell just This happened? is not a good place to be. <laughs> Explosive decompression in the Sulaco. I would be not okay with this situation. At all. No, like the cracking? No. The hell? Oh. You have 20 minutes before a total collapse. Shut it down. Shut it down! You are running so slow. Oh my god! <laughs> what am I doing? Oh, I'm not looking at your screen, not mine. Oh man. Thank god there's iron sights. Yeah, actually I do like that. Although that's a big thing for me. Oh boy. We've got casualties. Several injured over here. You got Pulaski. Uh Tina seems to be spurting a little bit. Tanaka. O'Neal. O'Neal. Tolentino. K. Jelly. Private Jelly? Looks like he sent you over into this mess as well. Hunt? Hopper? Motion tracker. Hopkins? Alright, whatever. Uh, what? Oh. LB. Push LB for motion tracker. Got you two here. Uh. And I'm reading 2 3 to the south. Beyond the hangar, engineering perhaps. By the way, I'm on the bottom, Andrew's on the top. Wait. Alright. <laughs> I should know that by now. <laughs> this is already gonna be real. Movement! Sounds like two, three are holding position. Just up there, man. I don't see shit. Unidentified movement in their area. 
He's right, there's nothing back here! Tell him there's something moving and it ain't us! Are you done? Yeah. <laughs> Peter and I are going to Damn it. That's also a oh, alien ninja, reference, by the way. Ninja. Oh, you- what?! <laughs> oh wait, I think you actually got some too. It had rounds on both of ours. Or did you pick up some too? Oh, hey, look what I found, Kevin. Turn around. Peace. Turn around. Peter? What? Turn around. Much love. Wow. Yeah, I feel it. Okay. Yeah. Impact. Visceral combat. All right. Let's go check out uh, Sir, there's Happy McGee over here. Half an unidentified synthetic splattered across the deck in here. Which half? Well, he ain't saying much. Then find me a half that does. Actual out. Oh, look at all the little ripples in the shadow. That's awesome. We gotta find the other half. That's a non-slip grating. You know, at this point in the story, is Alien 3 started? Yeah. Well, see, that's the thing that the pilot for the other ship mentioned. I'm assuming she's a pilot. That the last time the ship was seen, it was over Fury 131. That was the prison planet in Alien 3. So this is after Alien 3. Oh, okay. Or during. After or during. Okay. Maybe it'll explain that more. Alright. Oh, dude, Dan, look around here. The lockers, man. Wait, wait, can you hear my motion what? tracker tick? You can't, right? Oh, yeah. Dietrich. Oh, we got people. Vasquez. Hudson. Oh, there's a gun. Oh, this is like where they picked up all their guns off the racks. Okay. Yeah. They are unpickupable guns. That is a term. I am not just pulling things out of my butt. Mm -hmm. Eight home. Gorman, that door sounds frightening. Oh shit. <laughs> Move it! Wait, just curious. Pull up, pull up your motion tracker. Look towards me. As I thought. What? Oh, you're on there. I am on there, but I don't bleed. Okay. You have a diamond. Yeah, I think friendlies have diamonds or something. Alright, so. Well, what about the purple horseshoes or the blue whatever? I'm oh, here we go. So here's this is the ones that were jettisoned. This is the ones that have the Ripley in them. Ejected cryo tubes. Hell of a way to wake up. Hell oh, yeah. Wait, Quintarnino? Was that you? Was that me? Wait, what? I don't know who's talking. Okay, these, this is the room. This is where, where. Where do we got? How do you do flashlight? Oh, it's uh, down on the deep end. Oh. Um, Frost. So, so if we're looking for an Alien Three reference at this point, there should be. An egg hanging upside down somewhere in this room. Oh, is that really where it was? I think so. Huh. Okay. Or, 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 hey, or we could go back out to the hangar and look for it. Dietrich! Heck, I'm going back to the hangar. Hey, Pone! Gorman. That is not the hangar. Wait a minute. Actually, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa! Are we looking for cornbread? <laughs> I have one Are we question. looking for cornbread? I have one question. Where's the cornbread? <laughs> well, I guess they didn't like the cornbread either. <laughs> Alright, let's go. <laughs> oh, God! Oh, crap! I saw it. What? It was right up here. No, you didn't. I did. I, I, there was, like, the tail. Oh, oh shit. Uh, I uh, do not back up. <laughs> really? Right. Okay. Uh, dude, cut the door. I'm cutting the door. Breaching! And drinking beer. We could probably turn cutting doors or welding doors into a drinking game. <laughs> uh oh. Oh, that. Now that's not part of the original schematic. Now it gets real. Holy shit. Are you seeing this, Captain? Ew. Again? Um, got a oh, body. I hate that sound. Jesus, no. That's gross. Alright. Um, wait, motion tracker. Well, okay, so I guess there's more than just an egg. Well, but if this is after, 
then a lot's happened since that Alien 3 scene at the beginning. Right. Right? Theoretically. Oh, found him! What? I found Rhino 2-3. Where am I? Winner! How do we get over to you? Uh, I'm gonna cut him down. Magic. Cut him down. Oh my god! Get up! You gotta be kidding me. Okay. <laughs> Come cut me down! That is why co-op is a win. Yeah! Yeah, I just shot you in the face. Come on. I think, oh wait, actually, I think on Ultimate Badass, friendly fire is off. Or right. on or whatever, so we could kill each other, so it's probably for the best we're not doing that. <laughs> At least for your sake. For my sake? I mean, I'm real life? Yeah. Oh, yeah, probably. Okay, so we know, now, uh, our characters haven't seen these before, right? But as the audience, we know this guy is this guy's fucked. Our mission was to recover the flight data for the loss of all. I gave you that. We should probably just kill him right now, do him the favor. I know. We have to know what caused this. The flight recorder can get us that, with all due respect. Sir, my respect. squad means you shut your goddamn mouth and follow your orders. Actual out. Damn the man. Save the Empire. Okay. Okay, I'm just gonna say this right now. No. I love the fact that it is in fact 1980s camcorder. Yeah. So attention to detail. There's a lot of attention to detail. Oh. Foggy man. This looks like some sort of secreted resin. <laughs> Dude, why is he all green? Oh, man. oh god. Oh, what the oh. hell? Why are you locked out? Oh, you got teleported? Yeah, because okay. that's what that is. Oh, it's got the halo teleport. Yeah. Alright. That guy over there is playing Galaga. He doesn't think anybody's looking, but... Yeah, we noticed. <laughs> <laughs> Press... what? Oh, I got the tracker. Movement. Oh! Whoa! Dude! Uh, sorry. That is bad. Oh, crap. Move it! Go. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Yeah! Tracker. Right up ahead. Oh! Crap. Crap. Frackin' toasters? Ah! Frackin' toasters? Is on the top of the stairs. I see it! Ah! I can't take my gun! Ah! Ah! No! Ah! <laughs> I got acid on me! Gotcha. Oh, dude, you, you're out of armor. Watch our backs! Ah! Ah! What the hell? He jumped me and then I'm dead! I'm dead, I'm coming. Oh crap! He shut the door! Oh, he's welding it! Oh, he's back. He started welding the door as soon as he died. Alright, I'll get the flight recorder. I'm getting... Go pathetic! Round. Oh, cool, it does give ammo to both of us. That's awesome, actually. There's no way the flight wreck didn't tape the assholes that did it to the Sulaco. If we make it back with this thing, who knows what we'll find on it? Yeah. I could use that. It gave it to both of us. Oh. Yeah, you got armor when I picked it up. Oh. Which is awesome. Oh, hello. Short controlled burst. Got another one. His burst is a little shorter. Oh. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Winner, you got eyes on the target? What target? Ah! 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 Oh shit! Grenades are not for close quarters. <laughs> Where are you? Press me, boy. Press me. Holy crap! 
That was bad. Oh, you. Oh. Do you lose all your. Oh, no, you do get your ammo. Oh, my God. Hey, but on the plus side, we got a uh, uh, thing. We got a thing. Oh, wait, do we rank up? No, uh, uh, achievement. Oh. Okay. All right, you know what? We're going to have to end right there. Or at least for this one. Okay. Yeah, we're going to do this in a little half an hour burst. So uh, thanks for watching. Click the adaptation top right. Check out the next video. Um, we're going to talk more beer. Oh, come on.